good morning, Morning Star Saints, and uh, this is Pastor Jeff with uh, this week's Monday Morning Devotion. Now, being saved, uh, as you should probably know, is a matter of the heart. Um, we come to some point in our life where we realize our sin has separated us from God, and we need a Savior, that being Jesus, who died on the cross for our sins. But prior to that, we probably thought, I'm going to make it to heaven based on my actions. You know, I, I do good. Uh, I'm not as bad as the next guy, but that's an external thing. God, our relationship with God is based on what goes on in our heart. Well, likewise, sanctification is also a matter of the heart. Once we're saved, God doesn't just leave us in that state. He wants to continually work in us to make us more and more like Jesus, and that's a matter of the heart. Uh, today's verse addresses a couple behaviors that originate in the heart, and it comes from Philippians 2, verses 14 and 15, where it says, do all things without grumbling or disputing, that you may be blameless and innocent children of God without blemish in the midst of a crooked and twisted generation among whom you shine as lights in the world. Now, grumbling and disputing can have both an external and internal aspect, right? I, we can uh, keep our mouth shut and not grumble against someone or, or uh, raise a dispute with them, but that doesn't mean it's still not going on in our heart. How many of us, me, me included, have grumbled inside when something's not going our way or we're asked to do something we don't want to do? It, it's, it's still going on in here, even though it's not being reflected out there. It's a matter of the heart. Likewise, a dispute. Maybe we're fighting over some hill with someone and we're thinking of that next move we're going to make with them. Even though we're not doing it, it's still going on in our heart. Well, God wants to change that. He, he continually works on us, our heart through the process of sanctification. And... Um, it's not dependent on our own power. Just like God saved us by his power, he also works his process of sanctification through his power. All that's required of us is to daily yield to his work in our life. And why does he want to accomplish these works? Well, the end of verse 15 tells us why. It's because he wants us to shine as lights in the world. He wants us to be blameless without blemish in the midst of a crooked and twisted generation. You see, the more we're like Jesus, the more we're going to stand out against the world. And the more we're a light, the more we're going to attract people to Jesus and the more people that are going to come into the kingdom. So this week, saints, let's, let's let God really do that work in our hearts and see what he'll accomplish in our lives. God bless you guys this week.